Today we're talking about pressure dressings and one of my favorite bulky dressings, the Olace Bandage. It uses this little plastic cup to put direct pressure right on the wound. You can reach for a pressure dressing like this if it's not a big bleed and it stops with direct pressure. You can also consider converting your tourniquet to a hemostatic dressing if you have the training and you anticipate a prolonged extraction greater than two hours. If the victim's not in hemorrhagic shock, so the person is sound of mind and has good pulses, not an amputation, and you have the personnel and the equipment to closely monitor for bleeds. As you can see, the Olay's bandage is bulkier than most and it has this little compartment over here with compression gauze. So you position the bulb right on top of the wound and you just wrap. The cool thing about this dressing is it has Velcro stops. So once you go over here and drop it, it stays in place. And if you want additional pressure right on top of the bulb, you can twist as you're wrapping. Secure in place and you're good to go. Let me know what you want to learn next.